Hello and welcome to another brief technical preview of new features in development in the Mars release of the Eclipse Papyrus project. Today we'll look at the integration of the new modeling assistance capability into diagrams based on the new uh, in development modeled element types. So the prototype of the new element types service currently is implemented for use case diagrams. So we'll look at modeling assistance in use cases. So what I'd like to be able to do is add new things to use cases like extension points in the pop-up bar uh, and add new connections using the connection handle assistant. So we can start by adding some diagram assistance based on the core UML uh, element types for the use case diagram. So what we'll add is a pop-up assistant for extension points in use cases. So on an element that is of use case type, we'll pop up uh, a tool for creating extension points and between use cases we'll add connection assistance for include and extend relationships and between any pair of uh, named elements we can create dependencies and a connection assistant for associations between any pair of classifiers and in the context of a use case diagram classifiers are use cases and actors. It's a very simple uh, example of an assistance model for use case diagrams. <clears throat> so let's go ahead and deploy those modeling assistants and now we see in the diagram we can add an extension point. That looks good. It uh, doesn't have much to say about itself here. But more interestingly, uh, I can add an association to a new actor. I can add, oh, no, I'll do this the other way around. I can add and extend, presumably based on a new extension point, to a new use case, or rather from a new use case. So that. Uh, that's the backwards connection handle. <clears throat> so, neat stuff for the basic UML diagramming. But what's more interesting for our users, particularly in the, uh, in the Mars release, will be diagram assistance to uh, assist in creating models based on user-defined DSLs with UML profiles. So let's consider a very simple profile for use case diagrams in which we have a web scenario stereotype for use case. We have a stereotype for extension points. We have a couple of different stereotypes for actors. <clears throat> and I couldn't think of a good name for a stereotype for associations. So in the new uh, scheme for modeled element type definitions to plug into GMF in the Mars release, this is the so-called Chaos 2 project, I can define uh, element types very similarly to what I would do traditionally in GMF on uh, an extension point. I can define element types for all of my various uh, stereotypes that extend or specialize the element types from the use case diagram that are generated from GMF. I can give them names and they're basically all uh, in this very simple example they're just uh, element types that match elements that have a particular stereotype applied and advices for creation of new elements to apply 
the, the appropriate stereotypes. So why don't I go ahead and uh, deploy those element types into my runtime. And for uh, correspondingly in my assistance model, I have a pop-up assistant that creates um, branch point type uh, extension points in a use case that's stereotyped as a web scenario. I have again the include and extend uh, relationships from UML that my profile does not uh, customize with stereotypes. Same for dependencies. And this uh, st arbitrary stereotype of an association between uh, use cases, actors, whatever. So some uh, examples of the, uh, the various diagram assistants that we offer. So more interestingly, <clears throat> uh, in the context of connection assistance is the set of, uh, of element types that are supported for creation of new source or target ends of of uh, connections in the diagram. Those are the element types corresponding to the meta class extensions in my profile. And uh, this model already has that profile applied. So why don't I go ahead and deploy that assistance model. So now we see that I can, for example, create a new branch point. And we can see that, in fact, that is an extension point stereotyped as branch point. I can create a new include from a web scenario. So this is an appropriately stereotyped instance of the use case. Oh. There it is. And I can create a new web association to a user, say. Uh, the stereotype ends up down there for some reason. I can create a new association to browser. That's another stereotype that we have of the actor meta class. And hey, why not create an association between these two things here, just like that. That completes our brief demonstration of modeling assistance for user-defined profiles based on the new dynamic element types infrastructure coming up in the Mars release of the Eclipse Papyrus project. Thank you.